just getting in that groove of what I got to do for this. And... You're certainly more seasoned at this than I am. It sucks me and John Collins got put on the bottom. I don't want to have to take out my teammate. But if that's what I got to do to stay in this game, then I'm going to do it. How are you doing, man? Putting all the competition and everything out of my mind, I'm just going to do a nice tattoo. I feel pretty confident that I'll be able to produce a tattoo that's nicer than Cervantes. I can see how it might be hard for some people to go against another teammate. I don't feel that way. I'm sending him home. Let me show you what I got for you. Nice fighting rooster with a lot of texture. Looks good. Nice. Team Nunez picked black and gray animal realism as a fair style for me and Nate Beavers to fight over. Dave's was smart. That rooster has two totally different textures in it. Nate Beavers has been doing animal realism for about 25 years now. I've done about two or three of them. This is an opportunity for them to take me out. I think Nate's going to kill it. I think Nate's going to kill it, too. I'm an owl. Cool. I can take that right on. It's going to be badass. A head-to-head -head tattoo with Dave? This is what I've been hoping for. I'm going to send his ass packing right now. OK, artists, you have six hours to face off tattooing against your teammate. One artist from each team will be eliminated. Your time begins now. All right, let's do this, brother. Let's do it. Let's get this this one. Face-off situations create one of two things, complete success or total failure. Can I see that stencil? I'll just work through it, add all the texture I need. The battle royale begins. What do you think, Gia? My personal opinion would be to angle it down, because it's more flattering on the I'm body. I'm kind of liking the way that it's placed. You know, don't but... change your plans. Both teams are doing animals for black and gray realism. Texture is abundant. Wet pupils, feathers, fur, teeth. Today would be a great day for somebody to really show off. I suggested tilting the head, because right now it's like falling back on the thigh. And he was like, mm, no. If you don't take advice from people that know what they're talking about, your tattoo is going to suffer. Especially going up against me. I think Team Nunez picked black and gray animal portraits so I could not only beat Dave, but obliterate him. The majority of what I do is animal portrait work. Unless lightning strikes me, Dave's going home. I ain't gonna lie. I knew that Dave would take offense to it because he knows that Nate can do this stuff. That's the name of this game. I feel like both teams are really working together and plotting against me. Coming from a Jewish family, I was very guilty for becoming a tattoo artist. You're not supposed to be tattooed because you're a Jew. I came here to prove to my family that I deserve to be a tattoo artist. Three hours, guys. Three hours remaining. What we're shooting for today is texture. I ain't worried about nothing else. I'm capturing texture in this by showing the smoothness of the horns and every wrinkle in this rhino's face. Double elimination. This is crazy. I feel like the team who picked the subject matter most definitely hooked me up. Black and gray realism is my wheelhouse. Good job with the liner, man. But this is gonna be a tough one. I think Savon's got me, man. That oh, rhino oh, is man. tough, bro. Hold up and tough, bro. Yeah, but he's got all the texture. I've never done a portrait of an animal. I do American traditional tattooing. There's no texture in that. I'm gonna go back in and add darker, like, feather shadows in there. I think that'll create more of a highlight, too. I have two daughters relying solely on my abilities. The pressure's on. If I don't nail this tattoo, I'm going home. This is your final hour. One hour remaining. This is pretty loose. Maybe just run a crisp line. It's like black? Yeah, it'll help it. That's red as It is pretty red. He kind of beat that Honestly, today is not going to be a good day for Team Nunez. Whatever happens, we're losing a strong competitor, and Team Peck is just losing dead weight. I feel like so far, Nate, this is like his first chance to do something that he likes. Seeing Nate pull that off, I was not expecting that. I think both of my guys beat the <laughs> out of you, Dave. The whole team pretty much wants Dave out. I feel like when we started out the teams, overall, you probably had a stronger artistic front on a team, I had a little bit stronger of a positive mental attitude team. Getting the first week or two out of the way, the weaknesses are really becoming more apparent. Five, four, three, two, one. That is it. Time's up. Machine's down. No more ink. 
It's already a lot less red. Yeah. Dave's tattoo is looking like it hurts. The skin looks red, inflamed. Bye, Dave. <sighs> yeah, that looks good, dude. Thanks, man. The texture of it, it's like you can almost pet it. I'm happy with this. Hey, YouTube. It's Chris Nunez. Don't forget to subscribe to Spike's channel.